Uh, I think that's recording. Well, how did I first become interested in trains? Just great fun. They were thoroughly noisy, dirty, and dangerous. But but you know they they were they enormously uh, appealing. I mean there were enormous numbers of boys on all stations. Yeah, um, because I mean it was described as the best free show on earth. And so in those days, you, you know, I could just toddle off down down to Port Meadow, that part of Oxford where the railway ran across. And um, I I remember seeing my first train and. Um, being, being captivated, really. Well, it was the fun of it was the fun of the speed and um, um, all sorts of um, aspects, really. The, as I say, the rather like bird spotting that you you know you see an odd appearance of something you didn't expect, which makes it very similar. And I've known people who've, who've switched between birds and trains as a sort of yeah hobby. Um, but because the man I'm thinking of said, you know, he, he knew that he knew that the steam was going, and he couldn't bear the thought of it, so he switched to birds. Well, one wonders, one's tempted to wonder if if um, if steam, and and therefore the fascination of steam, hadn't gone from the railways in 1968, whether I'd have bothered to go back to models at all, but. But um, once once you you get onto live steam models, you 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 know you're you're beginning to recreate the uh, the feeling of the real things. Well, of course, I I I first of all joined the what was called the Gage O Society. And I remember one morning in bed, when, when I got up, um, and Mum heard the postman arrive, and I came up and I said to Mum, oh, it's, um, it's just something from the Gage O Society. And she said, there was a long silence, and Mum said, Tim, is there something you haven't been telling me? <laughs> because Gay Joe sounds like <laughs> Gay Joe. But um, uh, we, we sorted that out. And then I went, um, and then, yeah, the, the Gay Joe Society gave way to Gimrol, which was the Gage One Model Railway Association, and uh, to which I still belong, and uh, advertise in their journals. Yes, I make, I make, um, <clears throat> I make the coaches for people who have engines that they run around their garden. I only make to order, um, make these, you, most of them are gauge one, 10 millimeters to the foot. My boss and I were at, uh, at dinner, well, not the dinner. We we were out and travelling together, and he he was some kindly suggesting that the axe would fall sooner or later. And what was I going to do after when it did? Uh, which was which was thoughtful of him, very nice. Um, and to be fair, I did um, try for a few other jobs, but it became quite quickly apparent that I wasn't going to get any other jobs. Really, so. What did you apply for? Level, level crossing keeper. Really? Fiskerton. <laughs> I think they came to the conclusion I was overqualified for that. I do sometimes regret that I didn't have a career in transport professionally, is it? Well, it had gone, it had gone, it had just gone, it was, it was awful, it was ghastly, I mean it was, it was, it was you know, it's, it, it certainly made a, a permanent effect on me I'd say, yeah, I mean, I mean, I mean if you imagine every football supporter in the country, everyone interested in football, sorry, football stopping, no more football, ever, nothing, 
you know, it was like that, for, for, really, for the, for, with the trains, because, I mean, there were many train spotters as football enthusiasts, I'd say. And I mean, yeah, gutted, absolutely. But, uh, uh, there it was. It happened. So is this, this kind of thing that you're doing now, is that more like what you would have always wanted to do? Yes, probably, really. I, I get a lot of satisfaction from this and uh, it, it's great fun. You I'll... don't get bored working at home? And... Oh no. no, 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 not at all. Oh gracious me. Have you ever been bothered by people thinking that you're a bit... You know, <laughs> no, no, I haven't, no. Not at all, no. <laughs> no, it doesn't, no, no, no. <laughs> It's outweighed by the pleasure and the satisfaction. Um, yeah. 